The first snipe event I sailed was in 2008, uh, the Women's World Championships in Spain. Um, I was skippered for Kathleen Tuck. We had big wind, big waves, and uh, it was my first time in the boat and just was didn't necessarily know what to expect and uh, just had a great time surfing the waves downwind and hiking the boat upwind. I love sailing in big breeze and uh, that's, that's what the conditions were and it was great. I think the crew definitely makes the team. Um, you know, you can't get a boat around the race course without the crew. And so having a solid crew and somebody that trusts you and you trust them to do their jobs is, uh, is so important. Um, it's, I can focus on my job, they can do their job, and neither of us have to worry about each other. Um, I, I definitely couldn't do what I do without my teammates. Yeah, Molly and I have been sailing uh, for a year and a bit now in our Olympic campaign, so it's coming to this new boat for both of us and uh, you know, have the, this crew that understands each other. Like We don't have to talk about like the little things in the boat. We can just talk about big picture sailing. Um, having a regular crew is definitely key to being successful, I think. What makes the snipe different from other classes is the fact that it doesn't have a spinnaker and you sail with a whisker pole. Um, for us, you know, we sail a lot of boats with kites, um, so to come into a class where we put the pole out, like forward, say, on a, on a reach, it's uh, you know, backwards thinking for us, but um, it makes it interesting, makes it fun, and it brings new techniques uh, to dinghy sailing. I do a lot of keelboat sailing, so for us to come back and hop in a small boat that's uh, fun, responsive, um, it's a lot of fun for us. It's very physical, which is the type of boats we like to sail. This regatta was a um, perfect opportunity for us in our campaign. We do a lot of match racing, one-on-one -on -one boat stuff, and we don't do a lot of fleet racing. And uh, after sailing this event in 2008, I had such a fun time, and the fleet is great that uh, we figured we'd come back and try it again. One of our goals uh, coming into this event was to work on our tactical sailing and to, we didn't want to go to an event where there wouldn't be great sailors and you know, after my experience last time um, we knew there would be really good sailors here and people that sail the boat a lot more often than we do um, which would make it that much harder for us. So uh, we were very excited to hear the list of people that were coming and uh, knew that we'd be able to work on our goals when we'd be here. You know, the snipe class is very friendly. Everybody is willing to swap information. Um, it's great to see a class like this because, uh, you know, sometimes on the Olympic circuit it's much more serious and there's a lot of secrets that go around. Um, so uh, entering into an event where there's people that are willing to just share info, is, uh, it's nice and relaxing and makes you feel welcome.